what's up guys and welcome back to another video right into my youtube channel today i'm going to basically tell you how to fix every kind of fps dropping frame dropping or stuttering issue you're currently currently having with seven days to die so stick to the end guys this will be a step-by-step -step tutorial and in the end you will probably know what to do in order to fix this kind of issue before we start right into the video i just want you guys to know let you guys know that, that i would really really appreciate it if you would just leave a like a comment or a subscription right into my youtube channel it would really make my day and help me out as a little youtuber as i am especially subscribing would be such a big support for me guys you would support my work here on youtube a little bit and i'm gonna really really be thankful for that and i'm gonna thank you for that so anyways i would just say let's get right started so the first step in order to fix this issue is going to be to navigate to the very bottom of your screen you're going to right click and open up your task manager next step is going to be to navigate to the top left corner just to ensure you're sticking around processes and afterwards, I want you to click into CPU and end every single task, which has obviously nothing to do with Windows and uh, is having too much CPU usage at the moment by just simply right clicking and clicking onto end task and the same thing for a GPU. So let me explain that. Too many applications, background processes, programs, games, whatever, running at the same time in a low and bad PC with too much CPU or GPU usage will cause your PC to have stutterings, frame drops, FES drops whatever and by just simply ending those programs you're avoiding this issue once you're finished simply end the task manager again and the next step is going to be to navigate to the bottom left corner of your screen clicking onto the windows symbol and clicking onto the wheel and settings wheel navigating to gaming and sticking around the xbox game bar but once you obviously do turn this off because the xbox game bar doesn't really come with any benefit besides besides impacting your performance really bad you don't want that so just simply turn this off next step is going to be to click onto captures and go to background recording, go to recon in the background while I'm playing a game and obviously turn this off. Because if this, if this is turned on without you even knowing that, this will impact your performance really bad. You don't want that and you're gonna simply turn this off. And either way guys, you don't wanna record something with Windows so just turn this off and come back once in a while to check if this is really turned off. Next up is gonna be to click into game mode. And what I want you to do is gonna be to just, you need to check it for your stuff. So I can't tell, I can't tell you to turn this off or on. You need to check it for your system specifically and just security setting which is working better go back once and hit update and security stick around windows update and i know guys it's going to sound a little bit basic but trust me it will help you a lot by just downloading every single driver new driver you currently could download it will help you a lot with every kind of issue you're currently having and also with fps drops and stuttering so just simply download it it will help you a lot and start with windows so download the latest version of that and the settings and do the same thing for a graphics card. So go to the application, go to the browser and download the latest driver just to provide the best possible performance in general for your PC. That's it for the video. I hope that I could actually help you out, help you out with this one. If it was like that, just leave a like, a comment or a subscription. I'm gonna really, really be thankful for that. Yeah, guys, I'm really sorry if I couldn't help you, but I'm just gonna do my best in order to help you out. Either way, I hope you guys have a wonderful day. See you at the next one and bye.